In the name of trying to be humble, sons of God, we must take over. We must take position. We must take rulership. Are you hearing me? The devil is a liar. Our world is dying. People are dying every day. Yet Jesus says, In my name, you shall rest the dead. You shall cast out devils. What's happening? What's happening? Lions are acting like cats in the name of humility. Do you know that as I am now, I am here right now. I'm carrying out God's work. I am dangerous. Very, very dangerous. If you look at my eyes, you know I'm, I'm dangerous. The wave, something about me you can't explain. Why? Because I've entered that realms. And inside me are eternal plans of God. The fire, the coal of fire. God's intentions, God's glory have entered my consciousness. So now the Holy Ghost is seeing through me. Jesus is walking through me. So when I stand, it is Jesus standing. When I look, it is Jesus looking. When I stretch my hand, it is the hand of Jesus stretched. Why? Because a man has yielded himself to loving Jesus to a point where he became an embodiment of God's eternal plans. My name is Jacob Masopa. I'm from Botswana, and uh, I, uh, I was baptized uh, uh, with water. So my experience there, when I was baptized with water, I was caught up. That, that uh, you know, I, I, I was caught up somewhere where I felt like I was flying. I didn't know what was happening, so I cannot explain it in words. So I've been following the men of God for quite some time in the in Facebook and online. So then I decided to come here. So during the Sunday service, the man of God came to me and he he prayed for me and uh, you know I felt the power of God enveloped me so mightly that uh, you know sometimes words are difficult to express things of God. Um, I'm Yves Castano, Apostle, and my wife, Pastor Abi Castano. Uh, we come from uh, Congo Brazzaville. Uh, we have ministry uh, based in Congo Brazzaville and in France. We came to know uh, the man of God, uh, Pastor John Alosike, through the internet. Uh, I just want to say that it was God, because normally there was no way for us to get in touch with him, to discover it was really God. And for the last uh, maybe uh, three, two, two, two months, yes, maybe two months, two month, and uh, it was God. And um, uh, we felt like uh, we were pushed by the Holy Spirit to come here to attend. We had to do a lot of effort, a lot of fight to come here in Cape Town from Congo. We flew uh, like many others, uh, more than some, something like 15 years. We have to do a lot of sacrifices to be here this week. So we chose to come here to, to this week to be here. And it was uh, just uh, fabulous. My spirit is drawn to the church, drawn to the word. Um, because this word that you find here, you won't find anywhere else. There's nothing of the flesh. Everything must die of your flesh. And I'm coming here because I'm just seeking more and more and more deliverance. I truly want God to set me completely free. Um, 
show the depth of the word here is past religion. So wherever you are, if you are um, watching and you still may be thinking, should I, shouldn't I? This is the place to be. The word of God is true and it's sure it's mind blowing. And um, God can deliver you. God can set you free. He can do so much things for you. If you tapped in, come expectant, come with, with your fire and your expectation from home because God does do miracles.